There's one scene of Spirited Away that's just buried deep into my mind. The beautiful love of innocent friendship? No. The food that looks delicious, but also WTF is that? No. The fact that No Face has become the sexiest thing to cosplay as? No. It's this. When good old Chihiro pleads, Please, can't you give me a job? And Yubaba answers back with probably the coldest, meanest roast allowed on a children's movie. I'm telling you, any worse than this, and it would have had to be rated R. Why in the world do you think I should give you a job? Anyone can see you're a lazy, spoiled crybaby and you have no manners. This is a high-class place I'm running here. So there's no job for you. Now get out. I've got all the lazy bums I need. This scene? This scene is iconic. Because I'm the scene. I'm the scene. Job application after job application after job application. Job sites after job sites. CVs after CVs. Cover letters. Cover letters freaking ridiculous and they really shouldn't exist and they're just a uh, kiss ass to the company but anyway that's besides the point and i know i'm not the only one i know i am not the only 20 something out here trying to find a job that you don't even want and because this scene is just so iconic and so completely depicts the feelings of all of us in our 20 somethings right now trying to make it out here i'm gonna draw it 2022 version. Loqua Lela 2022 version. What does that mean? I don't know yet, but we're gonna find out. It's been a few days since I filmed that, um, and I look a mess, I know, but I kind of refuse to put on makeup and get ready just to do some artwork. So this is this is this is what's gonna happen. This is how we're doing this. I decided this is not going to be 2020 version because I couldn't think of anything to make it like 2020 version E. I couldn't think of anything to relate it to 2020. So we're just going to recreate the scene um, in my own style, which I don't really have a style, but I'm just going to recreate the scene as best as I can. Um, so what I did was I got up the movie on Netflix and I took screenshots of the images that I like from the scene. And then so what I'm going to do is draw those images. So I'm going to stop talking now and I'm just going to draw it. And yeah. I'm going to tell you guys right now, I cannot wait until I make it in life. So I do not have to film on my phone anymore because this honestly sets me back like three hours just deleting old videos, remaking videos, deleting old videos, deleting photos that I have, yada yada. It's like exhausting. Anyway, okay. So, I'm gonna just, I don't know if you can see here, but I've kind of also made a sketch of what I was talking about, where I want Yubaba to be kind of the main thing, because I think her words just have so much like venom that she needs to kind of be the bigger half, and then she's here down here. So yeah, let's just get into it then. While I'm drawing this cartoon, I also kind of wanted to reach out to those of us that are actually having a hard time getting a job um, because I was in that position for a few months um, in the beginning of the year. And during that period, what I would do was sit down, watch YouTube video after YouTube video after YouTube video about job advice and CV advice and stuff like that. So what I've done is created a PDF with all the notes that I wrote helped me with my CV that eventually got me my job that I have now and I've also linked two of the best videos that I in my opinion that helped me get the job that I currently have so that is in the description for free <laughs> if that's something that's helpful for you uh, definitely if you could just you know gently caress that like button caress it you know for me 
Okay, let's get back to the drawing after shamelessly trying to coerce you into giving me a like. Um, it's actually pretty flattering when a drawing that you're doing is going well. <laughs> so with you, Baba, I really thought I was gonna struggle, but actually she was easier to draw than Chihiro. You can see here, I am struggling with this side profile because I don't know how to draw anything, but yeah. done the sketch I think I'm going to dye the paper or like put yellow across the page because I don't like starting off on such a like white background I have painted it I realized a mistake I was not supposed to have that square in there Wear that Y in there, now that I painted over it, it's set there. So, but whatever, we're just gonna have to paint over it or something. Okay. I'm gonna make a color that is supposed to be the skin thin. Excuse me, now we got bad blood. You know, I used to be mad, love. Okay, so we've gotten a base layer for it. As you can see, I've gotten all the colors down, I guess, sort of. I'm being kind of lazy with it, I'm not going to lie. But anyway, now I'm kind of just going to go ham and I'm going to go crazy. And I'm going to do what I want to do to the image. I really want to doodle around it and make it messy and kind of like give it my own vibe type of thing. My own vibe type of thing. So I think it's going to be fun. The only thing is my camera only has four minutes left of recording time so it's just gonna go like that and then we're gonna jump to the end okay cool <laughs> We are just about to get to the reveal. But before we do, if you enjoyed this kind of all over the place drawing, Studio Ghibli appreciation-y, weird job application complaining video e, then please go ahead and definitely uh, like this video. Thanks. And there you have it, a comic that is supposed to adequately depict the situation that we're going through today. <laughs> I might as well take the time now to thank Studio Ghibli for making wonderful movies. I really appreciate it. They really touch the heart and the soul, no matter how old you are. So thank you, Studio Ghibli. And if you made it this far into the video, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope it helped you a little bit in some capacity. Maybe, you know, the notes that I had for my CV weren't that useful. But I hope you can just relate to the pain like I relate to the pain. Thank you for watching. My name is Loqua Layla. I do videos about art and this period of being in my 20s. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I guess I will see you. Bye.